Fintech has been defined as a digital technology that has the potential to transform the provision of the financial service sector. Our experience over the last few months since the occurrence of COVID-19 is that it is no more business as usual. During the hard lockdowns, we have seen how technology has aided many households not only to access financial services, but that has enabled provision of goods and services in other sectors of the economy. Namfisa's Fintech Square aims to connect the regulator with innovators to understand the technological and digital transformation in the financial sector. As part of their Fintech Square, Namfisa has also added a regulatory sandbox where financial innovators will test their innovations in a controlled environment. Uh, within this sandbox would not be it's not an open-ended where they are exposed to many customers it will be limited customers and this cast and that that will be exposed very few because we want to see how is it working is it working and what are the risks to the square we will be able to uh, have access and receive innovators innovations and uh, the selected ones will then be moved into the sandbox. The whole idea of the sandbox is presently the regulatory instruments we have may not necessarily speak to the innovations, fintechs, and all this. And we can't then say all, all technology must, must, must go back. If we don't regulate it. We have to find a way to be able to uh, simulate these products and uh, for those that can graduate, then graduate into, into the market. Namfisa has so far received 29 applications from innovators from across the country, from banking, non-banking, and other sectors of the economy for the fintech square. Julia Nafuka, NBC News, Ventuk.